this is Garland, and today we're going to do what's called photodynamic therapy on his face. Danielle is applying aminolevulonic acid, and this is a naturally occurring acid. And we do this treatment basically to get rid of these precancerous spots, which he has pretty much all over his face. Um, these are caused by too much sun over the years, and Garland has had a lot of sun. Um, he's actually had a couple of skin cancers on his face that we've needed to remove. Um, so we're doing photodynamic therapy on him to treat all these precancerous lesions to hopefully prevent the need for any more surgical excisions of future skin cancers. Um, right now, the aminolevulonic acid that Danielle is applying, um, we put it on. This is a naturally occurring acid that is in your body, but at a much higher concentration. We put it on and leave it on for about three hours. Um, and then we're going to put him under a red light. And the red light will photoactivate the aminolevulonic acid and actually kill the cells that it has been absorbed into. The cool thing about this is that the abnormal cells actually absorb the chemical at a higher concentration. So those are the ones, the precancerous cells, are the ones that get targeted by the light and get cooked, basically. So when he's done, he'll look like he had a pretty good sunburn. Um, he needs to stay out of the sun and even from, away from windows for 48 hours afterwards, and then he's done. So this, is, this procedure basically is done in place of um, some creams that are called Kerak or Epidex, uh, which is 5-fluorouracil. It's a chemotherapy drug that's used for colon cancers and things like that um, in a cream. So instead of doing that, we can put this non-chemotherapy drug on their face um, and treat them so they don't have to be putting this cream on their face for six weeks and endure a pink face for six weeks. We can do it in about 20 minutes. So now we have Garland here again. He's had the aminolevulonic acid, or ALA, on his face for a little over three hours. And Danielle here is going to go ahead and bring the red light in, and we're going to turn this on. He's going to sit under the red light for under 20 minutes. And the red light, as I discussed before, photoactivates the ALA and kills the cells that the ALA is inside of. So it kills the precancerous cells on your face. And uh, you'll see he'll end up looking like he's got a bit of a sunburn afterwards. So now Garland is done with the red light, and this is what you look like afterwards. So he looks like he's got a pretty good sunburn. And now we're going to wash off the ALA and in the sink, and we're going to put on some sunscreen, and he's going to wear a wide brimmed hat home, and he's going to stay inside. So he needs to stay out of the sun and even away from window light because there's ultraviolet light that goes through glass. He needs to stay away from ultraviolet light for 48 hours afterwards.